In the heart of every modern device lies a silent hero, the microchip. Have you ever wondered how these tiny components shape our entire digital world? Stay tuned as we delve into the fascinating world of microchip technology, revealing secrets and innovations that power our daily lives. Have any of you used a smartphone, computer, or even a modern washing machine today? What connects all these devices is a small yet powerful innovation known as the microchip. These chips often go unnoticed but play a vital role in our daily lives. Whether it's our mobile phones, automobiles, or household appliances, these silicon marvels are ubiquitous. However, it's essential to recognize that the process of creating these chips is far from straightforward. It involves intricate technology referred to as lithography machines. The more advanced we want our chips to be, the more complex the manufacturing process becomes. It may seem daunting, but let's embark on this journey together to demystify the intricacies. China, recognized as a global technological powerhouse, has demonstrated its prowess in chip design through companies like Huawei's Hisilicon. However, when it comes to manufacturing these chips, it's a different story. China has had to rely on other countries due to a critical component in the process, the lithography machine. Can anyone here identify where the world's most advanced lithography machines are produced? That's correct, they are manufactured in the Netherlands, home to ASML. Nevertheless, due to restrictions imposed by the United States, ASML is prohibited from supplying these vital machines to China. This restriction has presented a significant hurdle in China's pursuit of chip manufacturing capabilities. It's akin to having the world's finest chef at your disposal, yet lacking a kitchen to work in. However, there's a surprising twist in this story. Reports suggest that China has developed chip manufacturing technology that doesn't rely on the traditional lithography machine. This raises the significant question. Is this claim indeed valid? Why has the lithography machine posed such a challenge for China? And how is the country addressing this issue? Furthermore, what exactly does this new chip manufacturing technology entail? These questions lie at the core of our exploration today. An executive from ASIMO once humorously remarked that even if you provided Chinese engineers with the blueprints, they couldn't construct a UV lithography machine. Although it may sound like a jest, it carries a profound truth. The complexities and intricacies involved in constructing a lithography machine are monumental. This is the juncture where the story becomes more intriguing. The lithography machine isn't merely an expensive component of the semiconductor manufacturing puzzle. It represents approximately 25 to 30 percent of the overall cost. Not only does it rely on fundamental technologies, but it also necessitates a robust supply chain. Do you now understand why ASML executives would make such a statement? Nonetheless, relying solely on ASML's technology is not the route to becoming a dominant player in the industry. Allow me to share an engrossing anecdote to illustrate this point. During the technological shift from 193 nanometers to the 157 nanometers process, ASML encountered a critical decision point. The conventional path was to further enhance existing technology. Industry giants of the time, Nikon and Canon, opted for this well-trodden route. However, ASML chose to embrace innovation while others regarded the emerging technology known as immersion lithography as excessively challenging and costly, ASML not only adopted it but also succeeded. So, what can we glean from this? Innovation, courage, and the ability to seize opportunities are the foundational elements of success. Can China replicate this achievement? In brief, the answer is no, but this isn't due to a lack of effort. Success isn't a one-size-fits-all proposition. In today's rapidly evolving technological landscape, adaptation and innovation are essential. However, the story doesn't conclude here. Following Huawei's challenges, countries worldwide, including European nations, Japan, South Korea, and Russia, are actively exploring independent research and development of lithography machines. Manufacturers such as Kioxia and Canon are taking steps to disrupt ASML's monopoly by introducing the NEIL process. This breakthrough has the potential to revolutionize the production of 5 nanometer chips without relying on ASML's UV lithography machine. So, is the future of chip manufacturing in China as grim as it seems, or are we on the verge of a breakthrough that could redefine our perspective on semiconductor technology? 
Now, let's closely examine this new technology with the potential to revolutionize chip manufacturing. What is NIL technology, and how can it achieve the production of 5 nanometer chips without the conventional UV lithography machine? MIL, or nanoimprint lithography, is analogous to an artist using a stamp to craft a masterpiece. This technology circumvents the need for the traditional UV lithography machine, promising not only innovation but also substantial cost reductions, up to 90% less than the production costs associated with traditional methods. This, my friends, represents more than a mere ripple in the waters. It signifies a monumental shift that could reshape the entire industry. Take a moment to ponder this, a technology that enables the production of high-end chips at a fraction of the cost. So, what does this imply for ASML, the present leader in lithography machines? It's a two-edged sword. While their monopoly could be in Geoparty, it also provides an opportunity for rejuvenation and growth through competition. Innovation, as we know, never rests, does it? However, when it comes to China, the nation is far from being a mere spectator in this rapidly evolving landscape. On the contrary, China's determined efforts in developing lithography machines have yielded significant results. The country is no longer solely a consumer of technology, but is undergoing a transformation into a creator, innovator, and most importantly, a valuable contributor to the global technology arena. As Wang Chuanfu, the CEO of BYD, eloquently put it, Chips are man-made, not gods. This profound statement embodies the spirit of innovation and the belief that human ingenuity can overcome challenges. Now, I'd like to share something truly remarkable with you. China has achieved a groundbreaking milestone in chip manufacturing technology through the research and development of mid-range lithography machines. Large-scale production is on the horizon, signifying China's expertise in key technologies. But that's not all. Research into UV high-end lithography machines is also in progress. The Chinese Academy of Sciences has successfully installed the first domestic high-energy synchrotron radiation light source equipment capable of engraving high-end processed chips. Consider the possibilities. Furthermore, China's chip union technology has introduced a 3D fourth-squared DRAM architecture technology, which represents another chip manufacturing process that eliminates the need for a UV lithography machine. This strategic move not only offers cost-saving advantages, but also circumvents international restrictions. So what does all of this mean for the future of chip technology in China? It sends a clear and vital signal that China's chip technology is pushing the boundaries and entering uncharted territory. If this technology continues to advance and mature, China's chip production will no longer be limited by traditional lithography machines. We'd like to leave you with this profound reflection. In China's history, we've witnessed remarkable achievements from the creation of two bombs and one satellite to the development of shield tunneling machines, subsea immersed tube technology, beta satellites, 5G, and much more. The nation has transitioned from a position of relative insignificance to catching up with, and in some areas, leading the world in technological advancements. So what lies ahead? As we've observed, greater challenges often lead to greater motivation. China's enduring resilience could very well catalyze a technological revolution within the global chip industry. Ladies and gentlemen, we are currently witnessing a pivotal moment in technological history, characterized by rapid change, innovation, fierce competition, and limitless possibilities. As we contemplate the future, one thing remains certain. The chip industry is not solely about silicon and machines. It's a realm of human innovation, unwavering courage, and an unrelenting pursuit of excellence. What breakthroughs in microchip technology do you think will most significantly impact our future, and how might these innovations transform your daily life? Feel free to share your thoughts and perspectives in the comments section below. Don't forget to become a part of the Revel Discovery community by hitting that subscribe button to stay informed about the latest technological advancements and innovations. Remember, as we delve into the realm of technology, the possibilities are limitless, and the future is filled with exciting discoveries. Keep exploring.